Hey guys, Mike here from Magic Muffer and Break, and today we got ourselves a new video and a, well, not quite so new vehicle. Today we got ourselves a 1978 Chevy K10 Chevy Silverado. And on this one, of course, old vehicle like this, it's got to have the legendary small block engine, the Chevy 350. And on this one, the customer's doing quite a few things, so he's kind of rebuilding it from the ground up. Uh, so he has, uh, he, he doesn't have the tuning completely dialed in, but he said, Mike, you know what? It's a 350. It's a 4x4 truck. I need it to sound mean, but at the same time, man, I don't want it to kill me while I'm driving it because I'm going to be dailying this a little bit. So, honestly, it was a no-brainer. We went ahead and started off in the front. Customer provided us with some long tube Flowtech headers. Went ahead and installed those for him. Ran new pipe. Put in a nice little H pipe here in the middle to help keep uh, give a little bit of a uh, equalization. And of course, like I said, something that was going to have a good, nice hot rod sound without killing them. That's right, guys. Black Widow. And in this case, we went ahead and went with the 300 series. This is the uh, quietest version of Black Widow that I know of as, at the time of this recording. Uh, and I'm not gonna lie, guys. I say that I say that uh, word quiet loosely. Uh, as you guys know, Black Widows are pretty aggressive, so no matter what you go with, whether it's the Race Venom, the 250, or even this for the 300, they're still going to have a nice aggressive sound. But of course, with it being a 300, it'll be a little bit lower on the volume. From there, we went ahead and ran the pipes right out the side with the shorty exhaust, and we capped it off. <laughs> this thing's still smoking from when he, we were running it a few minutes ago. Uh, capped it off with these beautiful two and a half inch inlet, five inch outlet tips. And actually, I'm just gonna stand back just a hair so you guys get a better idea of the vehicle and the and the stance that it's got. Sorry, we've got all that stuff in the way. But as you can see, large wheels and tires, large tip, long bed, and honestly, that thing just looks perfect. But of course, like always, nobody shows up to see how good this stuff looks. Everybody wants to know how good does it sound. Again, long tube headers, just the H-pipe and the mufflers. We know that this thing's gonna be loud and aggressive. There's no cats on it. Uh, but let's see how well, how aggressive it actually is with these 300s, okay? Here we go. have it again you can definitely hear it the idle it's definitely got that uh, lopey hot rod sound to it again the 2000 rpm not that bad but obviously when you get on the gas whoo, it wakes up in a good way so again guys like i've been telling you guys we don't just specialize in your vehicle's exhaust even though clearly as you guys can tell we absolutely do but we specialize in your vehicle which means brakes alignments tune-ups ac oil changes whatever we can take care of it for you, especially, obviously, like I just said, the exhaust. So, if you want your vehicle running right, you gotta come see us. And if you want your car sounding right, like this 78 Chevy K10 with the Black Widow dual exhaust, you gotta come and see us here at Magic Muffer and Brake today.